Hurry home, my darling, sail upon the skies. Dawn is free of charm without you here. Sorrow growing roots now, I'm ever growing thin. Waiting for my world to spin. So there I stooped some years back, as lonely as they come. Misguided and misled to say the least. Secure behind the whiskey, brave. The past couple of months, all I can think about is her. The way the light caught her face as they scanned every inch of her body. The expression will never be erased from my memory. Like a rabbit caught in the headlight she stared at me, straight into my soul for a moment. We had a connection like no other. And one that I wished to never experience again. But you wouldn't understand the burden I've had to endure for these months. The pain I felt reliving the incident. Day after day, night after night, hour after fucking hour. But you wouldn't understand, would you? You weren't there that night. How could I have been so irresponsible? So stupid. Maybe if I was going a little slower. Maybe if I'd stayed at home or walked back from the pub, this shit wouldn't have happened. But this is the only way I can see of getting out of this. The only way I can at least try to make it up to her. In some sick and twisted way. Train. Bridge slitting my wrists. Even getting run over. And yet, it just doesn't seem enough. <laughs> I'm just so sorry. But I can't do this anymore. It's just too painful. What the fuck? Who the hell are you? And how the fuck? This, this is all a dream. This is, this is just a dream. When I when I open my eyes, you you will be gone. Well, technically, I'm a spirit. What the fuck's going on? Who the hell are you? I'm the woman you ran over. Marcy. Don't you recognise me? But she's dead. I mean, I mean, you're dead. How can this be possible? Like I said, I'm a spirit. You have nothing to be sorry about. What do you mean I, I have nothing to be sorry about? I fucking killed you! Yes, but it wasn't your fault. It wasn't my fault? Of course it was my fucking fault. I was the one driving. I was the one who was was over the limit. I was the one who was speeding. How was it not my fault? I'm 
so sorry I put you in this position. I was selfish to do what I did and I regret every second of it. I thought that by killing myself I would end up in a better place. And... Are you? No. You weren't selfish. How could I have been so stupid? Who drives in the state that I was in? I could, I could barely walk, let alone drive a car. I was selfish. I was weak. I couldn't go on the way I was living any longer. I could have done it differently, but I just had to do it that night. If I hadn't, things would have been so much different for you. You wouldn't be feeling like this. You wouldn't be about to do what you're going to do. If it, if it wasn't you I hit, it, it would have just been somebody else. My, my wife would still be divorcing me and getting everything she possibly can. Please, please tell me how it could be different. You can fucking lighten me. For starters, your wife wouldn't be leaving you. Yeah, like you'd know. She wouldn't. You would be at home with her right now looking through that big book of baby names. It isn't too late. You can still have that life. All you need to do is put the gun away, go home and go to sleep. Tomorrow's a new day. You can start over. No, I, I can't! Yes, you can. <laughs> that will be your wife asking you to come home. She, she needs to speak to me. It might be about our baby. This, this can't be from her. What do I do? Go see her. She misses you, Charlie. She wants to see you. Okay, okay. I'll go see her. Thank you, Charlie. Secure behind the whiskey, brave behind the beer. Nowhere far with no one near In walks you so sudden As sure as sure could be Confidence the angel to your flow I'm not going back with you, Lucifer Marcy, Marcy, Marcy Is that any way to greet an old friend? Oh, you are coming back with me, Marcy. You committed suicide. You belong to me. Yes, I know that, Lucifer. <laughs> I've atoned for my sins. I don't belong to you anymore, you piece of shit. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure you did. But that still doesn't change the fact that you committed suicide. The big man up there, he doesn't look lightly up on that sort of stuff. I know that. However, I also know that if I save life, I can earn my place in heaven. I am forgiven for what I did. You, heaven, you'll never be forgiven. Fuck you, Lucifer. I have atoned. Suddenly I'm so lost, even slow. Out of reach and out of words. So hurry home, my darling. Sail upon the sky. Dawn is free of charm without you here Sorrow growing roots now I'm ever growing thin Waiting for my world to spin